All right, mates, finally got the fucking quality. Ah! Okay, so off camera, I turned down the difficulty, beat the shit out of that dude after a few tries, and here we are. Difficulty is back up. Not unlike my cock. Let's never speak of that again. So we met that dude in there, and he was all like, Mate, I'm gonna get binned, and then he died. And he said we would find some bullshit on his fang. <coughs> Which I'm assuming is here. Oh fuck, I'm controlling the dog. <coughs> well, damn it, making me sound like a deviant or no. And our Ivnant Nori is almost completely fucking full. <coughs> Simple wonder in person. Yes. <coughs> I hear something slopping in the background. I bet if I bin something, I'll need it. White slob slobulon. Litany of Abula. As this man said that <coughs> if I eat this, it'll protect me from some bullshit. So naturally, I will eat it. I saw it, yeah, I'm a little sad. It looks good, but I'm a little sad because I think that the, uh, the coloring and heralding uh, might actually have been that that I misunderstood and I want cor coloring and heralding and shit looks cool though like shave some old stanky witches minge and Make a cloak out of that shit. <coughs> Very fine. Not a lot of assholes here. Got it. I've been denied most of the chair. Well, I'm hoping. Mage bullshit I need to sell. Book. Can I get you a ladder? Oh, Jesus. Get off hey, we dinged from a f fucking book. Mm, he has all the decks you'll ever need, I think. Which makes me happy. Mm, strongness is importante. I have one uneven stat that makes me very angry. Oh nice, finally. Dual wild expert and spinnery. in the book lost in dreams did I forget something over that's there better than later oh, oh Jesus Christ fucking sound makes me shit the fuck are these All right. Let's make this quick. dragon are you living I never said that. I did not say that. Bala Mo Mongolus. <laughs> right away. Oh, nice. Damn it. 
Mm. All right, skeezer, ski, skidooly. It's all right. Hmm, that's worth a lot. <coughs> Weird. Now nah, fuck the shield. Yay, English person. What? Alas, I cannot pick up the beef bone, but I can insert this into the dog. Yeah, <laughs> I've painted the dog. <laughs> uh, that's expensive. As in from England. What? Oh, okay. I don't think he is. How do you like me, dog? The log. Uh, dog, dog, log, log, dog. Alice is getting a bit prissy. My mum was British. I thought she was Belgian. What, did you just live there? I have engaged the anger. Yes. Blow up and slather me in your flamey bullshit. Oh, she was, a, she was in quite a state, was she? Tank it. I crouch forge the fire. Not a single shit given. Worthless. Yeah, sadly I couldn't crouch forge this guy. Got it. <clears throat> it was a sad time. Beast man, stay uh, fuck. <laughs> Why can I not sort by value, please? <laughs> he didn't always fall asleep. I scare away new man with my my shit talk. I'm sorry, Scooza. stealing if it's his you should know that oh look uh, a room with no oh he's Satan never mind oh he's mad Pint size punter was extraordinarily shit though. Oh, 
He would sometimes die just to see if he was alive. Oh, was that him? I forget. Ready. Mongulus bellows angrily. Yes. God damn it. Right away. As you like. Now's better than later. Allow me. I could do that for you. Fucking pint punga. <laughs> bork, bork, bork. <clears throat> See anything interesting? Wait, what? Item received. <laughs> Very fine dog. That's a wonderful thought. I don't know what to say. Oh, how dear of you. Thank you so much. It's in it for the money. Wait. Nah, she's just French. She's from Orlius. Borf, Borf, Borg. Oh, he does his fan. Look at him. Boof. Boof. Walk. Ah. This trick again? <clears throat> I know what you are. It won't work. I will stay strong. What won't work? Uh, enough visions. I if anything in you is human, uh, kill me now and stop this game. He's delirious. He's been tortured and has probably been denied food and water. I can tell. Here, I have a skin of. Don't touch me. Stay away. Filthy blood mages getting in my head. Uh, I will not break. I'd rather die. That can be arranged. <clears throat> okay, so some dude. Uh, snap out of it. Have no time. I'm a dwarf. Silence! I'll not listen to anything you say. Now T be gone. Time is tall. Still here. But that's always worked before. I close my eyes, but you are still here when I open them. That's called blinking, you idiot. You're pretty dense. Don't blame me for being cautious. The voices, the, the images, so real. Did Gregor send you? How? How did you get here? Uh, I'm here to cleanse the circle. Good. Kill Aldred. Kill them all for what they've done. They caged us like animals. Looked for ways to break us. I'm the only one left. They turned some into monsters, and oh, there was nothing I could do. 
<laughs> Be thankful it wasn't you. Don't think I'm not grateful. But why should I live when my friends lie dead? Their bodies and spirits broken? To think, I once felt pity for the circle. Now I'd like nothing more than to wipe their taint off the face of Thedas. <laughs> Rest easy, I will accomplish this. You understand what you must do. I would help, but as you can see, I am in no position to do anything. Come back after this, man. My cage is Aldred's doing, or one of his mages. Once they're dead, I will be free. Oh, nice. Stay safe, I leave. Sometimes terrible things must be done to protect <coughs> the greater good. I wish you luck. The greater May good. the maker turn his gaze on you. What? I thought religion generally didn't like the gaze. Good to see a maker that that even uh, encourages that sort of stuff. Wibbly wobbly wibbly wobbly. Do you accept the gift that I offer? This is salami, man. It's the Middle Ages, they're all wood. I'll just kill you. Fight if you must. It will just make my victory all the sweeter. So you say. I'll immediately get angry. You turned into a big flame chicken. Fucking explode, old poultry. This man contains not his own flatters. Okay, Alistair, stop being right there. Good man. I guess I need to use the thing. <laughs> Alistair freezes in the fucking animation, the dumbass. There's a dental mod. I play for five minutes, ladder comments immediately. Oh, God damn it. Mm. 
dog. <laughs> Foul abnomination. Whoa, uh, 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 uh. Asler to find himself forever stunned. No, ah, please. Crotch Forge is on fire. Our last healing potion, Aslister. Immediately turns around, attacks finer man. God oh, damn it. The fuck is a special power do? He's talking like she found someone that would like to kill her. I have some poison I can apply to this ass, not the venom though. Whoop, there we go. May end me. Uh oh. Uh oh. I think Forge might be going. I mean, sc Scrotal Pain. Whatever I named him. Help me, help me. I thought there might be some Leorio in here, but no, I guess not. Let's grab some glory. Man plays grab ass with glory. Make it grab. Oh, I can cancel those, I assume. Attack! Charge is not ready. Good to go. Uh. Interesting spot to save. <laughs> you should. Yeah, he had a problem. Hmm, did stun him. Ah, 
I guarantee you, I have even less than you think. Uh oh. I should have cancelled it. Alistair, for fuck's sake, get up! No, that kills him. I had to spell. Chronishing Prusun. Hey, Poo. Yeah, fuck him. just kills me. <laughs> well then. I wish there was a proper cast bar for that so we can see what we're doing. Crotchy is stuck in the prison now. Which means I can't interrupt that bullshit. All these fucking ads that just explode. Ready. Didn't that actually work on him? Hmm. Old Fred, you say? Right away. Here comes Ursa and his friend Ursa. Do you have the spell on you? They'll basically kill you. Oh, I used it just two seconds too early. Well, 
Well, I was stuck in bullshit anyway. Uh. He has not lost a lot of health. Forge stays around in a stupid fucking kill animation so that he can be stunned and killed. to some sloyd foo I'll get up uh, well I'm dead then Also, shite film. Supposedly should prevent it. How did you take damage back there? Alright. Hmm, he doesn't get stunned apparently. He's taking a long time. Hey wait, I have fancy arrows. Oh, I'm already using them. Shit. Halfway. Make his breath! 
See, he attacked the dog. Uh oh. Yeah, see that. So they go fucking. Gonna have to do this until I get more healing and we can come out the. Uh, we can actually get some stuff. He assaults me a great deal. Piss mate, no anger mate. A bass. over right let's fucking I say goddamn do I need things that aren't shite mate what the fuck what the fuck No, no ass touching. You goink. Ovnig. Shouldn't you be dead with the rest of the deviants? Maker, <clears throat> I'm too old for this, but I am alive, and that is something to be thankful for. My friend, the circle owes you its thanks. Come, the Templars await. We shall let them know that the tower is once again ours. I want to look around. All right, but please help. Are you ready to leave yet? We should sure. tell the temp. I'll need you to guide me down the stairs. Ugh, curse whoever insisted the circle be housed in a tower. <laughs> Finally out of here. I'm hoping I can upload the other video. It for some reason kept thinking I was streaming. Maker's breath. I did not expect to see you alive. It is over, Gregor. Aldred is dead. Aldred tortured these mages, hoping to break their wills and turn them into abominations. We don't know how many of them have turned. What? Don't be ridiculous. Of course he'll say that. He might be a blood mage. Don't you know what they did? I won't let this happen again. I am the Knight Commander here, not you. <laughs> what do you think, May? We have won back the tower. I will accept Irving's assurance that all is well. 
But they may have demons within them, lying dormant, lying in wait. Enough. I have already made my decision. Thank you. You have proven yourself a friend of both the Circle and the Templars. I have done your shit, mate. Now help I me. I promised you aid. But with the Circle restored, my duty is to watch the mages. They are free to help you, however. Speak to them. What? You mean first encounter? Yes, Irving. For now, I will have to oversee a sweep of the tower. There may be some survivors, and we should do our best to tend to them. Please excuse me. And Irving, it is good to have you back. Ah, I'm sure we'll be at each other's throats again in no time. Don't talk to Here Damn it. Are. The tower in disarray. The circle nearly annihilated. <laughs> Though it could have been much, much worse. I am glad you arrived when you did. It's almost as though the Maker himself sent you. It's coincidence, mate. From what Gregor said, it seems that you came here seeking allies. The least we can do is help you against the Darkspawn. I would hate to survive this, only to be overcome by the Blight. That's you. Have your word, mate. You have my word. You gotta As first use a proper weapon, though. The Circle will join the Grey Wardens in the fight. There is much to be done here, and I must go. You must forgive me for not being a proper host. I leave. When the time comes, we will stand beside you. We have convinced two or three mages to fuck around. You really killed all those abominations? I didn't think it was possible. I thought we'd all die here. I'm sure you need supplies after that, don't you? Yes. <clears throat> yeah, fucking all sorts of shit. <laughs> I sell everything. <laughs> Ulysses, Ulysses, sold. How many poultices are in body? Fucking runes. Do I need these gemstones for anything? <laughs> if I was installing windows that much as well I'd pass several laws at random
Mm. Mm. Oh, a hundred something. God, tire. This man bullshits not. What? 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 Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Damn. Double Mabugo crunch. Do not have any flasks. More. I wish I could have. I wish I could have gone. My men have scouted the tower. It's a mess, but the abominations are gone. You are very thorough. I'm impressed. I murder everything. I am quite impressive, yes. And I am thankful you arrived when you did. Okay. I shan't keep you then. I want to ask for Farewell. money. Are oh, you fucker? I'll get on it. The Lothera ring has been bin by the dank spawn. Alas. A blight. How will you end it? I'll fight Archdemon, mate. Is that all? It is surrounded by an ocean of dark spawn. How will you reach it? If you reach it, how will you slay it? You say you are a Grey Warden. I have heard stories of this order. What does it have to do with great it? strategists and peerless warriors? That is what we hear of the wardens. So far, I am not impressed. Won't be a dragon, mate. Not here to impress you, mate. Evidently not. It remains only to see what you are here for. Yeah. <laughs> Sten approves of this. Always, always. If you're fine with Sten, he's all like, oh, mate. Hmm. I Google a mod. Very fine mod, makes Sten look very fine. And of course, the fuck is that? Human box of resources you have collected for your troops. The fuck? The circle of Magi stands ready to assist Maggie, Warden, as do the Templars of the Chantry. Yes. Do you need there some shit, There are mate? always areas to improve on, Grey Warden. The most useful for my talents are runes. What do I get for this? Pood? What do you need now? 
If you really have to, go ahead. Oh, I see. Well, I'll just sell it then. Yes. I'm thinking something too. Well, here I am. What's it about minstrels? Of course I do. I love stories far too much to keep them to myself. Everyone should be able to benefit from them, I think. Nah, fuck it. <laughs> Dog, do you have any, any shite for me? No pet there. Fucking mage over here. Morgan. What do you wish of me? I can't tell her to leave. Ugh. You and your friends are formidable folk, indeed. It's good to have you along on the road. Mm, yes. What's your story, mate? Oh, nothing so unusual and so interesting as you and your companions, I'm sure. Dwarven merchants are common enough on these roads, aren't they? Your shit. I'm sure you'll be pleased with the good. So discount. This guy apparently is one of the most expensive fucking merchants in the game. I'll have your pissing backpack. That's all right. I This is for me. Need what her face to make some fucking potions to see what she actually needs for it. Maybe I can see in here. Anyway. God, dag nab it. No, I can't. Yes. You know what? Lost it. No. Nah. Yes. Indeed. Let me just see where it is we need to go. Damn it. I repeatedly clicked the wrong button. No, I'm I'm looking for Shale. I forget where it is she is. Hmm. 
Hmm. Yeah, Hollow, but I can't find it here. What's in Redcliffe? Mm, okay. Just gonna see something first. Let's go to Redcliffe then. Ah, oh, fuck. We have guarded our path, must venture ourselves. I bring word, sire. There are demands from the Banorn that you step down hey, from the Regency. They are said to be gathering their forces, as are your allies. It appears it will be civil war after all, despite the dark spawn. Pity. I also have an interesting report. There seem to be Grey Wardens who survived Ostagar. How, I don't know. But they will act against you. I have arranged for a. Jesus, that fire. A solution. With your leave. The Antivan Crows send their regards. An assassin? Against Grey Wardens, we will need the very best. <laughs> <laughs> and the most expensive. Just get it done. <laughs> Bend your badam baramba pam. Ah, a fellow traveler of the fair lands. Are you a seeker, perchance? Right, My packs man. are light, but I have a tome of strange origin. The Deus V Eternus. Rumored to be the last message to a sinful world from the Maker himself. Mate, you got two daggers sticking out your back. Did you sell a few copies in the Circle Tower? I have uh, no idea what you're talking about, and uh, neither do these large men carrying swords. Get them! You want me to get your large men carrying swords? Marco Oblio, mate. <laughs> Fucking son. <laughs> well.
Mongolius is on his way to R R Red Glidiff. Ah, a f rumored to be the last message to a sinful. I get the fuck. I'm teleported. Enemy ahead. Watch out. <laughs> I damaged myself? What the fuck? That is not supposed to happen. Pile of knees. No knees here, mate. No need. I appear to have flatulated the enemy to died. That's enough of that now. Wait, am I alone up here with Satan? Fuck's sake. Where are the bandages? <laughs> Less health. Yes, it's true. Coughing blood. Fuck's sake. Cameo cowl. Iridium daglet. Fucking dagger I'm using looks like some sort of wooden thing a guy called Dennis would make in the shop class. <clears throat> I'll get on it. They call me shit fuck and I'm a dance. No, there's. <laughs> A strike. You tell me, Saravok. Look, can we talk for a moment? I need to tell you something. I um, should probably have told you earlier. Let me guess, you're an idiot. Yes, that's right. I stopped you to tell you that I'm an idiot. Whew! Thank the maker you know already. Now I can stop worrying, I'll be found out. It wasn't exactly a secret. Oh, ho, ho. I'm trying to be serious here. Just listen. So am I. Well, uh, let's see. How do I tell you this? We're almost at Redcliffe. Did I say how I know Arl Eamon exactly? I hope this isn't something sordid. Uh, no. Why would you think that? Wait, don't answer that. Just let me finish. I'm a bastard. My mother was a serving girl at Redcliffe Castle, and she died when I was born. Our Lehman took me in and raised me before I was sent to the Chantry. The reason he did that was because, well, because my father was King Marek, which made Kaelin my half-brother, I suppose. So you're a royal bastard. Ha! Yes, I guess it does at that. I should use that line more often. I, I would have told you, but 
It never really meant anything to me. I was inconvenient, a possible threat to Kaylin's rule, and so they kept me secret. I'd never talked about it to anyone. Everyone who knew either resented me for it or they coddled me. Even Duncan kept me out of the fighting because of it. I didn't want you to know as long as possible. I'm sorry. Why I ought to... Does Log Logren know? Why wouldn't he? He was King Marek's best friend. I don't know if that means anything, though. I certainly never considered the idea that it might ever be important. Al Eamon eventually married a young woman from Orlay, despite all the problems it caused with the king so soon after the war. He loved her a great deal. Anyway, the new Arlesa resented the rumors which pegged me as the Arl's bastard. They weren't true, but of course they existed. The Arl didn't care, but she did. So off I was packed to the nearest monastery at age 10. Just as well. The Arlesa made sure the castle wasn't a home to me by that point. She despised me. <laughs> that sounds like a bunch of whining. <laughs> I suppose you're right. I wasn't raised as the Arl's son, though. If you're picturing that, I slept in hay out in the stables, not on silk sheets. I remember I had an amulet with Andraste's holy symbol on it. The only thing I had of my mother's. I was so furious at being sent away, I tore it off and threw it at the wall, and it shattered. Stupid, stupid thing to do. The Isle came by the monastery a few times to see how I was, but I was stubborn. I hated it there and blamed him for everything. And eventually he just stopped coming. Then you think the Isle will help us? I think so, yes. This news we've heard about him being sick disturbs me, though. I wonder if we won't discover that Loghain has come to the same conclusion as we have. So there you have it. Now can we move on? And I'll just pretend you still think I'm some nobody who was too lucky to die with the rest of the Grey Wardens. <laughs> Aren't you? See? <laughs> I knew you could do it. It's easy, isn't it? Fucking Alistair. He disapproves. It's not me that faster than you, Alistair. The fucking... Twenty is even strongness. Uno mace level, mate. Well, this is obviously mine. Fucking Yomas. Oh, that's a T. I thought I saw travelers coming down the road, though I scarcely believed it. Have you come to help us? I like Alistair, but dick playthrough. Get out of my way, I have no time for slack jawed fools. I, I, I'm not stopping you or anything, but have you even heard what's happened here? Has anyone? <laughs> Is this what uh, something I should care about? Well, yes, I expect so. If you're coming into the village, you can't avoid what's happened. We're under attack. Monsters come out of the castle every night and attack us until dawn. Everyone's been fighting and dying. We've no army to defend us. No Arl and no king to send us help. So many are dead. And those left are terrified they're next. Hold on, what is this evil that's attacking you? I, I, I don't rightly know. I'm sorry, nobody does. I should take you to Ban Tegan. He's all that's holding us together. He'll want to see you. Van Tegan, our Lehman's brother. He's here. Yes. It's not far, if you'll come with me. Thomas, yes? 
And who are these people with you? They are obviously not simple travelers. No, my lord. They just arrived, and I thought you would want to see them. Well done, Thomas. Greetings, friends. My name is Tegan, Ban of Rainosphere, brother to the R. I remember you, Ban Tegan. Though the last time we met, I was a lot younger and covered in mud. Covered in mud? Alistair? It is you, isn't it? You're alive! This is wonderful news! Still alive, yes. Though not for long, if Tern Loghain has anything to say about it. Indeed. Loghain would have us believe all Grey Wardens died along with my nephew, amongst other things. <laughs> No, not all of us died, maybe. So you are a Grey Warden as well. A pleasure to meet you. I wish it were under better circumstances. You're here to see my brother. Unfortunately, that might be a problem. Eamon is gravely ill. No one has heard from the castle in days. No guards patrol the walls, and no one has responded to my shouts. The attack started a few nights ago. Evil things surged from the castle. We drove them back, but many perished during the assault. I'll fight the things. Thank you. Thank you. This means more to me than you can guess. Thomas, please tell Murdoch what transpired. Then return to your post. Yes, my lord. Now then, there is much to do before night falls. I put two men in charge of the defense outside. Murdoch, the village mayor, is outside the chantry. Sir Perth, one of Eamon's knights, is just up the cliff at the windmill, watching the castle. You may discuss with them the preparations for the coming battle. Sure. Very well. Luck be with you, my friend. <laughs> Let us pray. Blessed art thou who exists in the Maker's sight. Blessed art thou who seeks his forgiveness. Blessed art thou who seeks his return. Fuck, I'll install inside Alistair for a bit there. Sacrifice to the Holy Church. You are of dwarven blood. And a stranger amongst us, yet you defend a home that is not your own. We are grateful for that. I don't care about because human got a dot. Look at the dog down there. <coughs> the maker smiles on those who aid his children, regardless of their beliefs. But I do not wish to irritate you. Allow me to introduce myself. I am revered Mother Hannah, head of this chantry, which for the moment is a place of refuge for these poor villagers. How awful this must be for you all. Is this everyone who's left? All those who cannot defend themselves, yes. They are terrified of tonight's attack, and I fear these walls will not keep them safe. What can I do to help with your task? A hand job wouldn't go amiss. It is the sturdiest building in the village. The women, elderly, and children will stay here during the battle while the militia and knights protect them. They set up a barricade outside the chantry to keep monsters from getting inside. If anything gets in, Van Tegan is our only defense. Please, have mercy. Help these people. Do whatever you can. May the Maker watch over you, child. <laughs> the holy ejaculate, yes. Your parents would want that. The second ejaculate of uh I'm scared, mother. Got it. One of the bad of men coming. Soon. When it's howdy doody time. Darling. Kitty. Don't worry. Everything will be alright. I want to go home. Hey, it's you're a grey warden, right? Why can't we go home? Were you in Ostagar? In the Kokari Wilds? My husband and son went there to bring the chant of light to the chastened. But I haven't heard from them since. Quality time. Hmm. Uh, it might be too late, Emberborn. I think if I leave here, this place get binned. Place gets binned now. Are you Jess? I am. You've heard of me? Your husband's son are both dead. I... I thought that might be the case. Thank you for telling Quality me. Quality time. I have some shit oh? here. Oh, his lockbox. 
If you're bringing me this... Oh no, I'm sorry. Thank you so Wait, much. Wait, I just for said he was dead. It means a lot too. Yeah, where it is. Make his blessings upon you. Just don't bless him. Give me money. I already told you. Fuck. Father is outside defending the village from the bad men. We must stay here and be brave. And pay. These are these are terrible times. I, Just I guess so. Good day. What do you need? There is not much daylight left. A hand job wouldn't go amiss. Jesus Christ, how many times do I have Very to? Very well. Luck be. Fucking wank me. I'm so scared. Sorry. Father. Am I bothering you? I'll, I'll try to be more quiet. Who are you? My, my name's Caitlin, my lord. Pardon my manners, but you're a dwarf, aren't you? I mean, that is what you are, right? I've seen a dwarf before. No, I, I just heard you were a Grey Warden, and I, I never thought... I'm, I'm sorry. Are you going to help us? Everyone says we're going to die tonight. I don't have much choice, mate. I can't even sleep. I'm trying not to decline I quests. I close my eyes and I see my mother being carried off. What have we done that the Maker allows this to continue? <sighs> you worry about your mother. I'm not worried about her. She's dead. I wish it wasn't so, but it is. It's my brother Bevin. He ran off, maybe tried to leave the village. I'm so scared those things got him. Aha, what would you give to find him? Yeah. I, I have nothing. Everything we owned is in our house. If you found my brother, I would be eternally grateful. Oh, please, couldn't you look for him? I'm begging you. <laughs> How grateful are we talking? I would do anything, sir. If you found Bevin, I would. Where'd he go? I thought he'd be at home, but he never came when I called him. If he doesn't come back tonight, I... I'm just so afraid for him. Silence, girl. Children to hear you. Maybe that's finally my my way to get the hand job. You know we don't have the men we need. I hope you know what and you're doing. Just keep growing each night. Well, sure, they take the day. Right, you fucking. You know. I don't, don't want to think about. Still no sign of them coming back from the castle, Murdoch. So you're the Grey Warden, are you? I heard they all died with the king. Just one's not skilled enough to save your sorry village. Oh, how nice of you to drop by and grace us with your magnificence. Maybe later you could show us which end of our swords to hold. We aren't going to turn aside anyone who wants to help, though. Don't take me for being an ingrate or nothing. Well, we do want to help however we can. You can trust us. Name's Murdoch, mayor of what's left of the village, providing we aren't all killed and hauled off to the castle tonight. <laughs> that sounds likely. Yes, well, I haven't given up hope. Not yet, anyway. Anyhow, you're here, and they tell me you're in charge. What can I do, man? We need what little armor and weapons we got repaired, and quickly, or half of us will be fighting without either. Owen's the only blacksmith who can do it, but the stubborn fool refuses to even talk. If we're to be ready for tonight, we'll need that crotchety bastard's help. Well, anything else? We could use some extra bodies. Having a veteran like Dwin in the militia would help a lot, but he flat out refuses. He's a trader, a dwarf, lives near the lake, locked himself up in his home with some of his workers, he has. 
Says he doesn't need any of us. <laughs> we could use somebody with his fighting experience, but he won't come out. All right. The militia will do what it can, but don't get your hopes up. Tell them to maintain watch. Attack before the sun goes down. Yes, sir. What should we do until then? Pray and hope for a miracle. Go away. Curse you. Leave me in peace. You've already taken everything out of my stores. There's nothing left. Open this door, I break it down, you fucking... My action here says you won't. Just you try it, looter! Be good, I said! Don't you try to come in here! There we go. Make his breath. What is that smell? It's like someone set a brewery on fire. Somebody's been drinking. You just come barging into my home. I've no money and nothing of value to take, as you can plainly see. So if you're here to beat on a sad old man, then all I ask is you get on with it. I don't have much to live for as it is. I'm not sure how far I am. Not very. I don't understand the other sentence. I keep quality options. I keep restarting to get quality options. <laughs> uh, no need for beating. Just got to do what I, I, I tell you, mate. What do you want exactly? Mm. The militia need to help me why should i help murdoch when he won't help me hmm? my girl Valena, is one of the alessa's maids and she's trapped up there in the castle but the mayor won't send anyone for her she's been my life since my wife passed on two years ago now she's dead or soon to be i don't care what happens to me or the village or anyone Hmm. Or we could work to help save him. I'm Mate. an old man. Everyone knows we aren't making it through the night. Or are you going to save us? Save yourselves? Not likely. And there you have it. We're doomed. So if I lock myself in here and drink quietly, waiting for the sun to go down, then I don't see the problem. Uh, Ultimate has all the DLC. If you want, I can put you out of your misery. If the need to kill me overwhelms you, go ahead. It's quicker than the drink or the monsters. <laughs> Fair enough. Oh, how about we don't? <laughs> Old man, harmless, drunk, any of these things ring a bell? Is that an argument for or against? Against? Fine, I'll let him in. Uh, interfere. Melissa needs your shit, mate. Why should I help Murdoch when he won't help me? Hmm? My girl, Valena, is one of the Alessa's maids and she's trapped up there in the castle, but the mayor won't send this. anyone for her. I'm fucking It'd get do her me the then world a good to think maybe someone like you could go in and find her. Provided any of us live through the night. They nickel and dime you for shit. Just get everything cheap. And if she's dead. It would be better than going to my grave wondering. Alright. Not good enough. Murdoch said the same damn thing, and I didn't believe him either. I want to promise. Promise me that you'll look for her, that you'll bring her back to me if you can. Yeah, don't, don't sub, please. Just follow if you want, but don't sub. I don't want people wasting money. 
What's stopping me from lying to you? Nothing besides your conscience. You got one of them. How so, Denmark? What? Not really, mate. And you should know the value of a deal. You want something, I want something. I'll accept uh. that. It's something to hope for, at least. Right then. It seems I have some work to do relighting the forge, and I suppose I'll have to find some iron. Hmm, maybe at the mill. Oh, Murdoch just better send his men here as soon as possible if I'm going to get to all these repairs and get them done by nightfall. If you need anything done, well, <laughs> just let me know. I've got a lot to do now, so you'll have to excuse me. Proves. Got it. Hey, I see you found my hiding place. I stuck some old equipment in there before Murdoch could get his hands on it. Right away. I don't think there's anything you'll need in there. But it's hard to say. I was in a bit of a rush when I filled it up. It's locked, mate. Yeah. Let me open it for you. I have the key. DN plus So much shite, but it's mine now. I see so close to leveling. Burdock. Well, it looks like Owen's finally doing the repairs we need. The damn fool is falling over a drunk and still manages to make smithying look easy. Good enough, I say. I'll send one of my men to inform Bantigan the militia is ready for battle. Still, I just talk to something. You'll find him and his men at the mill by the bridge to the north. Right. Let's hope we see morning. Oh, nicely Oreo leveled. Ah, oh, two one off. Fuck. I don't see why not. <laughs> On my way. Yes, of course. Key required. That's what lock picking is for. Hey, dog dinged. Mm 
Wolf, wolf, wolf. A fine creature. We see anything? Ah. You hear some huh? Whatever's inside the dresser, can I just open it? Ah, what are you doing? All right, I'll come out. Please, don't hurt me. I'll go back to the Chantry if you want. I didn't mean any harm. Sisters looking for you, fuck. I just didn't want to be at the Chantry anymore. Everyone's scared, and I want to be brave. How is hiding in the dresser being brave? I wasn't always in here. I hid when I heard you coming. I was... Well, I shouldn't tell you. It's a secret. Intimidate. Tell me I don't like secrets. No. I won't tell you. And you can't make me. You can't. Yes, I can. Hmm. said you were the one who found him. I can't possibly repay you. That brat's more of a problem than he's worth, mate. Oh, I'll take Bevan and stay out of your way then. Th thank you, again. Fucking... Should have asked for a, a kiss, but didn't like the moustache on her. <laughs> what now? I'll do it. I'm all gonna go in my money bags. That mill looks like it's gonna get binned if it's windy in any way. <laughs> Door's locked. Recently repaired. Could lockpick probably for more XP, but I find it more stylish Wonderful. kicking the door in. Intruders. I hope you have a good reason for breaking and entering into my home. Intimidate. Well, we'll go where we like unless you'd like to stop us. No, no. Have to run the place. It's not like I could stop people like you anyway. The name's Dwin. Pleased to meet you. Now, kindly tell me why you're here. No need for a militia, man. Uh, so, Murdoch's sending a dwarf to do his begging for him? Hoping I'll get all misty-eyed with thoughts of home? Look, I'll tell you the same thing I told him. I'm not risking my neck for this town. Intimidate. Either die out there or die here now. I've had enough of you strutting around like you own the place. Come on, boys. This ends now. Well, if you like. I'll get on. I am now stunned. Down you go. Yourself. 
<laughs> right, now help. Damn it, fucking messy kills. Now, now we go take what we wanted from him, which was for him to help. Oh. I think I understand now why this might not have been the best idea. shopping list more bow yorks can I get you a oh thank fuck we didn't get to hear it are you always coming yo yeah. late Kalina hard no swimming all right all right Could just put all the villagers on in boats outside during the night. If to do is disappear in the morning again. How the f <laughs> fucking fisk? How the hell do I get them to help now that they're dead? I feel like I may not have thought this through. So what do you think will happen to all those people we left behind in Lothering? Some of now them will find their way to Denerim. Many will die, as the Maker wills. Don't you wish you could have stayed there? To help more people, I mean. If the blight isn't stopped, everyone will die. This is the greater good we're serving, both of us, right here. So it's all right to let some people die for the greater good? I'm not so sure about that. I felt bad leaving all those people there, all panicked and helpless. You're doing what you must, Alistair. There will be worse to come yet. Mm. Heal yourself. Stuff you know up there. This. I've never been very good at that, the stealing myself part. I find it better sometimes to just be a little weak. <laughs> I'm all right with that, really. I don't believe you. And either way, it's not as if any of us has a choice. Mm -hmm. Well, nice, finally. Some shit. <laughs> Mogulus is, in fact, a hero. He's that one dude that is invited or insists on coming to D&D &D and just doesn't get it. I want to see the top of your head. Thank you. Fuck. <laughs> Blades of Arslok. Right away. <laughs> yes, what can I do for you? A hand job. Ah, oh, irregular man. 
I knew this time would come. I should have listened to my wife. Don't sign that paper, she said. They might pay you a few sovereigns now, but they'll be back. Last. I'll see you on the front lines, I suppose. Yeah, fuck off. Man goes straight out the door. There are many great tales of lost kings who return to their lands to reign in glory. I am not lost, nor for that matter, a king. And there's nothing glorious about me. You are Merrick's son. You are the rightful king of Ferelden. I am the son of a starstruck maid and an indiscreet man who just happened to be king. <sighs> Look, I can't be king. Some days I have trouble figuring out which boot goes on which foot. Complete fools are made leaders of kingdoms all the time. And you're not a complete fool. What an utter relief. And don't worry about the boots. Kings don't need to dress themselves. That's what advisors are for, isn't it? And starstruck maids, apparently. <laughs> yeah. One more strongo. Yeah, he's not the people <laughs> the hero people wanted, needed, or or even anything. Ooh, but he was the, the one I created. I'll get on it. Just took a ride on the sails of the windmill. Didn't turn out well. No word from Greetings, the Grey Warden. I am as relieved as Ban Tegan is to see you here. I must admit I am unfamiliar with addressing a dwarf of your station. I do not wish to be rude. I don't care what you call me, that's I not am true Sir Perth, until recently in direct service of Arl Eamon of Redcliffe. For now my charge is defending the village from these evil assaults. Would that I had chosen not to seek out the urn of sacred ashes. Perhaps I would have fended off whatever evil befell the castle. Or perhaps I would be dead. Ah oh, well, with the Grey Warden aiding our defense, <laughs> perhaps all is not lost. Consider using the oil, mate. No one told me of this. Oil, you say? How much exactly? Uh, Assuming fire. That would hurt Shit. Them. Yes, I see what you have in mind. That might be effective if used carefully. Yes, excellent idea. I'll send some men to collect the oil. We'll use it to slow these creatures down. Have you anything else to ask me in the meantime? Can I help you? We have sufficient name? armor and weapons, but my knights are too few to stand against the monsters without assistance. Perhaps you could approach Mother Hannah in the Chantry for some holy protection against these evil creatures. Otherwise, I do not know what else you could provide. It sounds like hooey. Talents. We're as prepared for the onslaught as we could possibly be, all things considered. Well, else do you need, mate? No, nothing comes to mind. If you have not spoken to the mayor, Murdoch, you should. His militia is far more in need of aid than we are. Yes. As you wish. All is still. Has been for days. Got it. Wind mill? What a bastard. So I'll dog mate's bit big enough for me to ride, I think. So gold, gold. At least he's not Sir Scorfollox. Greetings, friend. No monster. There's still time before sundown, though. Hmm. I wonder if Satan will appear. <laughs> oh, landmark's really nice. I can get the dog to piss on it and make him stronger.
Now is it's better than later. Forget if we went in. We didn't. This is a Tavon. Should not have been in here. Burgle Wurgle. Not looking for company. Shouldn't you be with the militia, mate? Why? I don't live here. What are you doing here, then, mate? Just waiting until I can leave again. Who are you? I'm not here to talk. There's something about this man's demeanor. Ah. Uh, I don't know. I have no idea what you're talking about. But you do, don't you? I know spy when I see one. Look, I don't know you, and I don't want to. I'm not... I mean, I was just told to... I mean, just leave me alone. Start talking, mate. About what? Just because you're a Grey Warden doesn't mean you can go around threatening people. Intimidate who's gonna stop me. I don't want trouble. I... I'm going to the Chantry now. Just leave me alone. Intimidate, stop right there. Answer my question. Elsor. All right, all right, I'll tell you. Just don't hurt me. This is more than I bargained for. Look. They just paid me to watch the castle and send word if anything should change. But they never said anything about monsters. I haven't even been able to report anything since this started. I'm stuck. Same as you, I swear. I kill monster. Who are they? A tall fellow. I forget his name. He, uh, said he was working for Hal. Arl Rendon Hal. He's an important man. Terran Loghain's right hand. So I didn't do anything wrong. <laughs> How do I know what's telling the truth? Here, this is a letter from them. It has instructions and everything. Keep it, do whatever you want with it. I just thought I was serving the king and making a bit of coin on the side. You have to believe me. I do believe you. No, I'm not dying here. And why not? Got it. Ha! <laughs> 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 nah. Man morphs through and splotches on top of the ass. Can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? Hello there, friend. Can't say we've ever met before. Stranger to the village, I take it. Haven't had many travelers lately. All this nonsense is bad for business. Bet you regret coming, yes? Yeah, this is business. Right. I've got some supplies, too, in case you're interested. With the store closed down, it doesn't hurt to pick up some of the slack, eh? Hmm. 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 Death root. Hey, what can I get you? Another doomed soul come to drown their sorrows here, I see. If you came here for a drink, you'd have to talk to Lloyd. He's got a vice grip on the spigots. I'm just here to keep the boys from mutiny. Do you know anything about the fucking elf? Not much. He's very quiet. Says his name's Beric and he's here to meet his brother, but I think he's lying. He's a bit creepy. He's very quiet because I've killed him. Keep safe. That's usually how that works. Didn't drop anything though, so he's a bit of a cunt. Yeah, somehow bleeding onto the table from below. What a feat. Mm 
Dolotai Kezuka Kazumai. I thought I thought I uh, shaken that fucking song, but nah, apparently. I hear both Murdoch and Sir Perth are ready for nightfall. Excellent news. Very well. Luck be with. What is it you need, child? I'm fucking dwarf, not a child, goddammit. I have done all I can for them. I pray for them each night and seek the Maker's forgiveness for their sins before they face their deaths. What Sir Perth seeks is something that is not in my power to give. Why for? I can pray with them and give them my blessing. But Sir Perth wants me to call upon the Maker to shield them from evil. Well, can't you just tell him the Maker will watch over him? Morale is a powerful thing, you know. You mean you want me to let them think the Maker protects them in a real sense? I will not lie to them like that. Intimidate. You'll help them because they tell you. Go down, do it speedy. You dare threaten me? To, to lie to these poor men? I will not do it. I will not be bullied by the likes of you. I suppose I should expect no less from you. Go. Be gone from my sight. We're not finished talking. I have nothing more to say. Me? Huh? I have nothing more to say. <laughs> I hear both Murdoch and Sir Perth are ready for nightfall. Excellent news. Of course. <laughs> Very well. <laughs> Well, I think we's about we's about ready. I thought it binned itself there for a second. I had a pool. What do you need now? Not you. The repairs are underway surprisingly quickly, you considering got a hat. how drunk Owen is. We may just make it. I talk about Dwine. Yes? What's he up to now? He's dead. That fool. I told him not to lock himself in there. I told him we wouldn't be able to make sure he was safe, but would he listen? Thank you for telling me. Another senseless death to add to the list, I yeah, suppose. There was nothing we could do. Shame. Good man. There's not much time before sundown. Are you sure? There's still time left if you need to talk with Sir Perth or do anything else. I'm fine, mate. And good luck to you. You'll need it. Party. Make ready. <laughs> Light the traps. Burn these foul creatures. How day? Bit early, aren't you? Dog, no. Undead, so filthy. Off I go. Got it. Log knows what it's about, it's true. 
Stop this in the The monsters are attacking from the lake! They're attacking the barricades! We need help! I'm right here, motherfucker. Don't yell at me. Come on! We need to hurry! What? Here. say on a proper one I'm falling asleep in my chair here which is good because I have I have Bloomhaven tomorrow so if we're streaming tomorrow it'll probably be a fair whack later than normal possibly also before I go so earlier but time for watching a uh, shorter stream here today on account of me being very tired so GN mate and tomorrow we 